Yo, it's Grand Bison, but text back us Matt Ultimate Team 16, and it is Sunday, and the positional sets are live. And I think this might be the first week that the positionals really aren't that, like, super expensive to do. And that is because these cards aren't really the great cards that we hoped that they would have been. So the left-hand set rewards a Michael Bennett. And Michael Bennett's card, honestly, is not that great. I'll go and show you guys this card in the Oshbox is ending up in a little bit. But yeah, the set's the same everything else. Got 25 gold, 15 elite. And here are the specific items that go on the set. You got J.J. Watt, Cameron Wake, Muhammad Wilkerson, and a 91 overall Calais Campbell. Now, Calais Campbell, if you look at his card, is not going for that much, man. 70,000 coins. That's not that expensive. I thought his price might be super high. That card is kind of hard to pull. I pulled a ton of pro packs, and I have not pulled a Calais Campbell or a J.J. Watt. And right now, the prices are fairly cheap, so... That is a reflection on how terrible that Michael Bennett is. And Michael Bennett was like a beast tart, 90 speed, 100 block shed, 100 power move, all that jazz. The car will probably be a little bit more expensive, but because those cars are so cheap and the collectible is so cheap, that means one thing. Michael Bennett is trash. The right guard set shocked me as well because a lot of the cards I thought we were going for a lot really aren't. So this Marshall Yonda is fairly cheap. Now, I know 100,000 coins is not cheap, but that's actually really cheap compared to how I thought this price is going to be. Like, I know people prepped for these sets and bought these cards for 80,000 coins, but when I pulled this card about a month and a half ago, two months ago, he was going for 100,000 coins. So that's pretty average if you ask me. We got TJ Lane, you got Brandon Brooks, and you got the Garrett Reynolds and the collector for this one's actually going for more than that uh, left end collectible. And I think the pull rates are the same. So if you look at that, that means that Incognito is not terribly awful but this michael bennett's trash let's go to the oshbach right quick and check out how terrible this michael bennett is here is the michael bennett and his stock is dropping you know, now overall left thing that's only four hundred thousand coins that's crazy right now so here he is 83 speed which is not the greatest but whatever 95 strength 94 blocks 97 power 95 attack 93 acceleration and does he have any hidden stats on him whatsoever let's see i know he has good hit power i think 92 which is not terrible but this card really doesn't look that special to me. Like, I know that it's a left end and it probably can't look that great, but then here he is compared to Zadarius Smith. And Zadarius Smith is only an 87 overall. Quote unquote. If you want to go ahead and say he's 93, whatever, but he's only an 87 overall. And you see plus two to strength in favor of Michael Bennett, plus two to attack in favor of Michael Bennett, plus one in block shed, plus four in. Power move in favor of Michael Bennett. And, you know, like, if you're going to be a 90 overall, you cannot look similar to a card that is only an 87. That's just my opinion. And that's why we say overalls don't matter. They just slap overalls on these cards and expect us not to uh, look any deeper into them. But, yo, I'm really upset right now. You know, like, I know it's a huge upgrade from what he used to have. Like, look at that. He went by 10 speed, by 7 strength, by whatever, that 9 acceleration or 8 acceleration. Like, he went up a decent bit. It just can't be like that. I understand. But, like, this card is no way in shape or form a 98 overall. No way. It can't be. It's not possible. And that's why this price is so cheap right now. I'm going to go ahead and stop pooping on Michael Bennett. I'm sorry, Michael Bennett. It's not your fault. I'm going to go ahead and stop pooping on you because you do not deserve this type of punishment. And let's go ahead and get on to Richie Incognito, a.k.a. the guy that got kicked out of the league for a year for bullying. As there is, he's up for 697. Yo, 697. Jonathan Mars no longer in the league. Richie Incognito is getting over here, over here getting 90 overall cards. It's crazy, yo. It's crazy. Life comes at you fast. So 6399 strength, which is crazy. 98 run block, 94 pass block with 96 impact block. Here he is compared to my current right guards. I've got many dudes out here, but he is the best at this position. So his price is probably going to be expensive for a while because he has the highest overall and the overall challenge that you need. To go ahead and knock out reward 100,000 coins, so his price might stay high because of that. And he pretty much dwarfs everybody else I have my team right now, so he is definitely gonna be worth the coins in a little bit. I'm just not about to spend that much coins on an offensive lineman unless they guarantee that I will never get sacked. I can't be getting sacked with purchasing offensive lineman for this much, but I actually have all the time in the pocket. But that card does look nice. It does look very, very nice. That is all I got for you guys right now. Let me know down in the comments section below how you guys feel about today's positionals. You guys already know my opinions. I'm high on that Rich Incognito. Don't really care for that Michael Bennett. I'll be dropping more videos later on today. I apologize for my voice sounding hoarse. Um... 
I am, I have a, my sleep schedule is broken and I'm tired, but I'm going to persevere. I'm going to give you guys the videos you guys want. Hopefully, my voice doesn't take away from the quality of the video. Hopefully, I can at least sound a little bit more excited so you guys can get past my deep bass voice, which kind of sounds a little bit boring at times. So, I'm a Texas. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you guys are new to the channel, hit the subscribe button and I'll catch y'all mother bleepers in the next one. Peace.